Hey guys, it's Jordan with National Speed. Now, every enthusiast I've ever spoken to who owns a Trackhawk absolutely loves it. And let's be real, anything with a factory 707 horsepower supercharged Hemi is hard not to love. But the one drawback? That 707 horsepower has to work against nearly 5,400 pounds in weight. Now, imagine with me for a second if I told you that despite that weight, your Trackhawk could beat up on the following cars. 992 Porsche 911 Turbo S, Gen 2 Audi R8 Performance, McLaren 570S, Lamborghini Huracan LP580, Gen 5 Dodge Viper, Dodge Challenger SRT Demon, Nissan GTR Nismo, Tesla Mata X Plaid, and the list goes on and on. Now, even better, imagine that this can be done without affecting what makes your track hawk a great daily driver. Sounds a little bit too good to be true, right? Well, that's exactly what our Stage 2 Plus E85 package does for your track hawk. This takes our Stage 2 package, which is designed for safe operation with 93 octane pump gas, and adds E85 and a bit more boost into the equation. So first, let's review what's included in our Stage 2 package. JLT Performance 125mm air intake system, Metco Motorsports 2.85 inch upper supercharger pulley, TBA machine tensioner and idler pulleys, Stainless Works long tube headers with EPA compliant GESI catalytic converters, Kong Performance ported supercharger snout, Kong Performance 108mm throttle body, Injector Dynamics ID 1050X fuel injectors, pinned crankshaft, Gates HD Fleet Runner Green Belt, properly gapped NGK LFR 7 AIX spark plugs, our in house PCM unlock with HP tuners credits, a custom calibration on the dyno to maximize power, drivability, and reliability, and HP tuners smart access cable. And since all Trackhawks are 2015 or newer, this means that the PCM must be unlocked before it can be tuned. And this package is proven to take your Trackhawk from around 600 to 610 wheel horsepower in stock form up to 760 to 770 wheel horsepower, all on 93 octane pump gas. Now, when the customer plans on running only E85, this totally changes the game. When running 93 octane pump gas, we have to keep the boost on the lower side for safe operation. But when we're running E85 full time, this opens up huge potential since we're no longer having to worry about octane limitation. And in this case, Frederick, the owner of this Trackhawk, opted for the latter and upgraded to our Stage 2 plus E85 package. This changes the fuel injectors from the Injector Dynamics ID1050X to the larger ID1300X, changes the upper pulley from 2.85 inch to 2.75 inch, and adds in an ATI Performance 10% overdrive lower supercharger pulley, a JMS Fuel Max fuel pump voltage booster, and a fuel with ethanol content analyzer. Now with the installation complete, check out the impact this has on the dyno. Oh yeah, safe to say that shows up. Output jumps up to a staggering 907.40 wheel horsepower and 802.24 pound-feet of torque. And the great part is that with a simple pulley swap and calibration change, this setup can also be run safely on 93 octane pump gas. But to get the full effect here, check out this comparison from stock all the way through the stages. Stock baseline. Stage one. Stage two and Stage 2 plus E85. Over Stage 2, that's peak gains of 143.26 wheel horsepower and 104.36 pound-feet of torque, with maximum gains of 113.27 pound-feet of torque. And over stock baseline, that's peak gains of 300.7 wheel horsepower and 219.36 pound-feet of torque, with maximum gains of 256.52 pound-feet of torque. And with our previously established drivetrain loss of 100 horsepower on this car, that puts our horsepower at the engine to 1,007. And dividing our new horsepower against the Trackhawk's 5,363 pound weight, that gives us a new power to weight ratio of 0.187. And that means that this super SUV can now go toe to toe with every single car that we listed earlier in the video. Absolutely absurd. And if you're ready for this level of proven performance out of your Trackhawk, we're ready to help you get there. Reach out today to learn more.